So which of the following characteristics is unique to an end-year endowment insurance when compared to an end-year term insurance, an end-year pure endowment, and a whole life insurance? So what this question is asking is, which one applies to end-year endowment insurance but does not apply to the other three types of insurances? Looking at answer choice A, the sum insured is paid if a death occurs before the end of the nth policy year. So in other words, a person dies within n years. So that's obviously true for an endowment and term. But for a pure endowment, the person has to survive n years. So that doesn't apply. And for whole life, it applies as well. So it applies to three out of the four. So that's not unique for the endowment insurance. Answer choice B, the sum insured is paid within n years, whether the policyholder lives or dies. So that's obviously true for an endowment. For a term, the person has to die in order to um, get the payout. So it can't be both living or dying. So it has to be strictly dying. For a pure endowment, it's strictly surviving. So if the person dies, then nothing happens. And whole life, the person has to die. So what we see here is that only this only applies to an endowment. So the answer choice is B.